This is Code.org. I'm currently working on their CS Discoveries course. I'm on Unit 3 Animation and Games, Lesson 19, which is Functions, Part 6. Calling functions multiple times. You often want to use the same code at many places in your program. Once you've created a function, you can call it as many times as you like. Do this. This code creates a sprite that moves across the screen once. How can you make it go back across the screen? Note, the function is already called once at the beginning of your program. Right here is where they're talking about set flyer. That's the function being called. And when the code hits set flyer, it looks for, wait a minute, where is something called set flyer? And runs the code inside of that. So it's going to run all that code. Okay. Read the condition of the if statement inside the draw loop. Oh, oh, yep. Flyer x if it's, hmm. Okay. Use the if statement and the function written for you to make the sprite move across the screen multiple times. If statement and function. All right. So what's the if statement? If the flyer x. So if our flyer's x is less than negative 50, where would that be? Negative 50 would be over here. So if it's less than negative 50, let's hit run right now. All right, so if our flyer is way over here, hmm. But the slit velocity is here. Hmm. Ah, but we set fire, flyer up here, so it's not in the draw loop. So if it's less than negative 50, why don't we change the velocity? Let's try that. Let's see if we can take this sprite, right? So if it's less than negative 50, our flyer is way over here. So why don't we take our velocity, set flyer velocity to, oh, not set flyer, yikes. Flyer. The flyer's name is Flyer. Uh, instead of negative velocity one, let's give it a positive one. Isn't that the opposite? Let's see. It's looking good. Going back. Read the if statement inside the draw loop. Why do you think it's there? Use this if statement and the function written for you to make the sprite move across this move across the screen multiple times. We got it. Here's my code. And mainly what we wanted to add is inside that if statement was to change the flyer's velocity to a positive one. And that way the flyer went across to the left once and then went back across the second time. For, uh, went back across the right. Great, let's keep going. 